Dat is een skill. Het doet mij direct. Oh ja. Oh ja. Hij adds to all the flavors. Oh ja. Dat is een beetje van die nog van. Ja. Goed. Zie je? Zie je dat? channel it's a special one today today we're having a video covering a day in a life so it's a day with me yes it's a nice and simple day you know, my normal day is like when I'm not traveling or doing anything crazy this is a normal basic day at home with training and everything behind with it so it's boring but this is what a typical day of my life trying to improve my physique and prepare for the Olympia Right now, middle of the off season, so we get to see the meals I'm having and get to see what a normal day at home is like for me. So, yeah, we just had breakfast and we're going to get on with our morning. So, welcome to the channel, day in the life. Let's do it. And I'm no champion. But you still gotta lower your, more your. Hey, Doggy, yeah. what are you doing? You still gotta cut your grass. I'm going to cut the grass. In the back garden. Hey, shut up, bro. <laughs> that's, that's, that's a very unusual thing with you. <laughs> <laughs> Are you for real? It doesn't happen very often. Oh, it doesn't, does it? No. Really? And you're an expert of watching the garden. I'm an expert of knowing how often you, you wash your nothing. hands. You know nothing. Oh, yeah. You know nothing. I wish. How come I'm the one that never gets sick? Mm. Yeah. You never get sick? Yes, I never get sick. I told you that. I never get sick. I heard <laughs> someone <laughs> tell me that. Has <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I got a strong immune system? Oh, good for you. Yes. So, explain. Ah, uh, second meal of the day today, and second meal is a nice simple one. We got sweet potatoes, which is about 450 grams of sweet potatoes, and 180 of steak okay how much steak steak is already 180 no it's 200 mince is 180 the, yes is on this is someone who cooks their own things look it's already pre-packed arguing you know, Sorry, so pre who, pre who pre-packs it like, exactly so and don't don't it all the time don't do it because you pre-pack it mm. don't be acting like an ass what oh, is it you're the one arguing in front of camera that apparently you're doing so much. Huh? I don't do so much. I cook it. <laughs> you pack it. That's why you know the numbers. I, I cut it. it. No, and I ex it. Exactly. So if I asked you now for a cooking steak question, like how do you turn on the barbecue grill? And I do it when you're away. Without burning the freaking house. How is it now? Like, we all know what happened this oh, weekend. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But who was doing that barbecue? And it wasn't me. It was, it was exactly, you. Exactly, it was your guest. Mm, and you. That you invited for my birthday. You, you set another fire alarm. That's my expertise. Mm, yeah. Yes. Oh, what? So, special season steak. I never have meals. Microwave it. Like I always say, people that watch uh, our meal prep videos. The reason why we 
prep our meal in bulk. And so this is quicker. So all I gotta do is plate it up and eat. It's no longer the thing of, okay, if I gotta eat now, I would have had to cut my time of doing anything else and start preparing the steak and the food all early and you would have taken more time out of each day if I have to prepare every meal fresh. But this way, five minutes, done. And I can focus on eating and moving on to something else. So if you have to prepare each meal as you go, you won't follow your meal plan. You just get bored, especially when you gotta eat six meals a day. You end up just drifting off because it puts too much work each day. It takes up too much time. So having everything pre-prepared in bulk, and then all you have to do is plate one out each time, it's mild, just insanely easier. And it saves up on a lot on now uh, electricity and gas and all the other stuff. That takes out if you don't have to cook six times a day. So hence why you know we have this idea of always preparing our food two weeks in advance, all in bulk and then just portion them each meal. And then I don't have to, we don't have to literally cook any of those heavy meals for two weeks. So, yeah. So. All right guys, good morning, good morning, good morning. How's it going, how's it going? Yes, it's Tuesday. And second day into this week, I ain't got much days left because I'm flying out to Texas on Thursday. So I already got one more full day at home before I gotta be out of Texas for a long while. I think pretty much over a week. So yeah, currently situation man, it's nice and simple. It's nice to be at home. It's nice to be have everything right there on deck. You know, training is steady, food is steady, everything is nice and simple. I'm getting a lot of rest as well. And body's progressing nicely, man, for where we are right now. It's just right on point on what we're gonna be. So for those of you that are gonna be in Texas and be at um, the Dallas um, Dallas show this Saturday, I will be guest posting at the show this Saturday. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Uh, gonna be going to Olympia TV. You know, you guys have seen the post. Me and Derek are gonna be hitting it head to head at Olympia TV come the weekend. Oh, okay. Full time. Full time, full time, full time. Full time. You know, I got my special sauce. That sauce is not special because everyone can buy it in Tesco. It's mine, so it's special. It's not yours. These two combinations are special not because really. it's mine. Yeah, it's mine, so it makes it special. It's different if it would be like a homemade... It doesn't matter. It's so mine, it's not special. special. Because when you mix two of them together, it becomes special. So you might be able to get one in one, but you won't get the other. When you mix them together, that's when it becomes a special sauce, not just by itself. Nice. That and obviously to pop my calories up, as you guys know, I am drinking a lot of juice and a lot of smoothies because we need excessive amount of calories at this time of our off season. So currently weighing in at just 327 pounds. Yeah, that's only a few pounds off my heaviest, which I was last year. But we're a lot leaner, and as you can see, I'm a lot more mobile. I'm cutting the grass, I'm walking the dog, I'm doing stuff. Oh, you're only doing this for camera, you know? Hey, what the? Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> Let me go there. I'm doing stuff because I feel a lot more comfortable at this weight now than I've ever felt. I even mm -hmm. thought it was possible to feel. Good stuff. So, yeah. Very good. I'm a child down. You're contributing to family life. Yes, I am contributing to family life. <laughs> it's a vital contribution. Alright guys, so we just got back from my walk and uh, I'm having my shake, so we I actually shake right now. So that's just, normally I'll have it with my, um, with the meal I just had before that, which was 6.1 steak, and I'll have a steak 20 minutes, I'll have a shake 20 minutes after. But because we were rushing to take myself for a walk, I didn't have it, so I'm having it now that we're back. And Mel is just giving Cerberus a wash because he's covered in drool. I'm playing with another dog, so they are the dog. I'm about to drink this down. Yeah. Alright, so what's going on? So, we're about to head off to the gym. I just got a leg session today. Well, and just I'm just. The light is. I don't want this. Light. Yeah, it's better. Yeah, so, so you've got a leg session. Got a leg session today, and obviously about to hit my pre-workout shake 
We just got us our delivery too. Yeah, what's, so, what's the box? Yeah, this nice yeah. box over here. It's coming in, something I was running short of. And it is a way I sleep. Like you saw earlier, I'm drinking a lot of mm -hmm. protein shakes now with my meals. You got it's two, off season. You got two tubs. So I just got two tubs. And a, a month, then two. Yeah, to run me by. So those are going to be going into the cupboard real soon. But in the meantime, yeah. I'm going to knock my intra workout something together. And here, my favorite, what I always do, especially for a good pump and a good workout. Got one and a half scoop of intro R3. Okay. And for that pump focus and motivation, I got one scoop of nut shot in that with it. I'm gonna knock that up. I'm gonna drink that through my workout. It's gonna be something. Nice. Oh yeah. Nice, nice, nice. And also you're going to eat on the way to the gym, right? Yes, because yes, yes. Because we... We were running late because we got to film our workout today. Uh, we'll we'll meet Thomas back. in the gym we'll in the next style. half an hour. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to, my mother's going to drive and I'm going to eat on the way. And then we're going to get to working. And then once that's done, I can start my evening of downtime. Yes. Love and then I can downtime home. work on my... <laughs> what are you working on? Well, I'm, well, well, I'm but, uh, no, uh, always uh, working uh, something, don't uh, uh, I? Uh, <laughs> you can work on your arm and, 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 and... You know what I'm working on. Uh, sure. <laughs> so what's going well on here? Tomek is filming. Good intense one. Tom um, managed to record that. It's going to be dropping in a uh, dropping out soon from today's leg workout. We'll be on the hostel so channel, right? On the hostel channel, that won't be. So yeah, before training, I had my pasta and minced meal, and minced it was beef. I mean it's beef, and it was uh what, hundred and eighty grams of lean minced beef and what was it, three hundred and fifty grams of pasta. Yes. So that was that. And then now I'm having my post gym meal. That was a pre gym meal, by the way. And then obviously I had my intra and bloodshot drink through the workout. Now post gym meal is normally, like I said, with my post workout shake, I normally do it two ways. If I'm close enough to home to have my meal first, I have my meal first. If I'm far away, that I can have to take some time before I get home to eat. Then I'll drink my shake and then come home and then have my meal. But this one, where the gym was just 15 minutes away, I'm coming home now and I'm having my... Do you want to show what is in your shake? Yeah, my, my shake currently right now is... Mm. What we got is... ISO H1. Two scoops of a hostile ISO H1. Mm -hmm. Hold on, let me just focus on that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Chocolate, milk chocolate flavor. Mm -hmm. And as well as that, I got two scoops of CDX. Car powder. 
as well in that. Nice. Yep. Mm -hmm. So that's what's my, that's what my sh is in my post-workout shake. But what I'm gonna do first, because it's hard to have a shake and then have a meal. Instead, it's a lot easier to have your meal first and then have your shake straight after. So I'm gonna have my next meal set up, which is right now my first rice and chicken meal of the day. So I'm having two cups of rice and 250 grams of chicken breast. And then as soon as that meal goes down, I go straight in and I have the shake 20 minutes after that. So yeah, that pushes up my calories quite a lot. And obviously as I'm eating my meal, throwing in the juices and smoothies to give that calories nice and high, which is what we got. So I'm gonna have that pushed up right now. In the microwave and it's done. And same thing with, you see earlier with our steak. Chicken breast is always pre-cooked, pre-portioned, and ready to go. Mm -hmm. So how much chicken breast do you have to So like I said, 250 grams of chicken breast. Nice. That microwave up. Mm -hmm. So this is juice that I'm making for both of us. Mm -hmm. It's going to be pineapple. Parsley, mm -hmm. pear probably, and some ginger to give us a kick. Actually, no, I'm going to put some lime in it mm -hmm. to keep it nice and fresh. Oops. Yes. Okay. So next step, ginger. Do you like ginger? Probably. Okay. So this is juice refresh, final product. Refresh. Oh. Mm mm. Ooh. Ooh. That's nice and what a fucking kick on it. <laughs> oh ginger. I think that ginger is really strong because I didn't put that much. Yeah, but ooh, I like it. <laughs> it's, it's hot and there's a eye watering but I like it. It's oh yeah, that would definitely show you cold. Oh yeah. Oh fuck. Ooh, serious. I like it. Alright, alright, alright. It's time for the next meal. It's late. About 9 o'clock, 9 p.m. And I'm going to get ready to my next meal going in. It was a special one. Normally, I would have chicken and rice if I was in prep. Or I'll have um, chicken and mashed potato or steak and mashed potato. But today, as usual, I'm having specialty Nando's. Basically, you're going away. Yeah. And this is going to be one of our last. My last meal before I went. Last evening to get a five and go away, so. Well, one more evening, but. Yeah. Kind of last. So evening. we can enjoy. Yes. Alright, let's see. Our oh. time. Right. Mm -hmm. So, what oh. did you get? Half a chicken. Side of some fries. Good for you. Mm -hmm. See, when I mean, you want to be a big body, but you gotta know how to eat consistently and eat big. Did you order fries for yourself? I think so. Or are they for both of me? No, I'll do it for myself. No. No. That's not a You got sushi. Oh, yeah, I got sushi. That's yours as well. Okay. Alright, so that's all I get. Nice. A little bit of fries. So, do you want to say good night? Um, my last meal. I got another meal after this for bed. I yeah, but, yes, but I think we're, <laughs> we're not going to be filming. <laughs> we're not going to film because we're tired. We're we want to eat and go to sleep. Yes. All right, guys. So I'm gonna say, I'm gonna eat my last meal tonight. But well, say my last meal tonight. My second to last meal tonight. Good luck with this. <laughs> I'm gonna have sushi again before I go to sleep. But it's late, we're tired, we're winding down for the evening. So I'm gonna use that opportunity to say goodnight to y'all. 
and if we're not falling asleep and we can bother to pick up the camera before we go to bed to film my last meal, this is a temporary good night. It's like good night in advance of good night. And that will just be a rolling video passing for the moment. If not, thanks for watching. We'll catch you guys next time. I'm hungry. We'll get going.